Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing a general love reading for Sign of Taurus. And keep in mind that this will not resonate for all of you. Also, this is for April, so if it's not resonating now, it could later in April. So, on the bottom of the deck, for the overall energy, we have the World Reverse. World Reverse, that is like a lack of completion, a lack of closure. Things are not over between you and this person. So, what happened in the past between you and them? We have the Eight of Wands. We have the Eight of Cups Reverse. Seven of Swords Reverse. Ooh. So someone was given a second chance. Or someone made a return. But what I also feel like is that they... It was found out that they did things that weren't right. Or they said things that weren't right. Seven of Swords Reverse. It's like the, the lies are exposed. And they came out. I do feel like you two started speaking again. And maybe this was found out afterwards. Have a look how they feel towards you. We have the Knight of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles reverse. Ten of Cups reverse. Taurus. So it's like they made a decision here. <laughs> to be slow. And not really offer you a committed relationship. Like, I, I'm not saying that they don't want to be around you, but I don't think that they want to be in an actual relationship with you. So they'd be wasting your time. Have a look how you feel towards them. We have the lovers. This is Gemini energy. We have the Six of Cups reverse. The Temperance card, Sagittarius energy. Taurus, I do think that you would want, you still like love this person, you still have emotions and feelings, but there's also like, you, you look back on the past, past events that happened between you, and that's like kind of where your mind is when you think of them as well. Like, and it's a very negative memories. Have a look at their intentions towards you. We have the Devil. This is Capricorn energy. Ace of Pentacles. The Knight of Wands reverse. Taurus, as I said, this person still, they're gonna be inconsistent. Now, I still see them like interacting with you, being around you, but they're still gonna have that inconsistent ways, and I don't see them like offering you the, the committed relationship that you want. They're very in and out. Have a look at your intentions towards them. We have the Emperor. This is Aries energy. We have the Ten of Swords. The High Priestess. This is Pisces energy. So, I honestly see you ending it with this person. I feel like you know things about them. And I see you focusing more on yourself. Have a look at the outcome between you and them. We have the Four of Cups reverse, Two of Swords reverse, Queen of Cups reverse. This is Water Energy. Taurus, I feel like it's going to be you two. This person's going to be missing an opportunity on you because they're inconsistent, and on top of that, they don't open up emotionally, and they made this decision to do that. It's a conscious decision. It's not, you know, them just not knowing what they're doing. They're doing that intentionally. Messages for you, Heaven Word 3 with marriage. Soulmate. Pay attention to the red flags. Worth waiting for. Creativity. Settling. Winter. So some significance with the season of winter here. And separation. Um, Doris, you are settling with this person. And I feel like you're going to be some... You're going to be with someone so much better. That you could actually end up... Like, in an actual relationship. And possibly even marriage. But not with this person. They have too many issues. Like, you've got better coming along for you. Okay, so, Taurus, that is all I have for you. 
Let me know if that resonates. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more content, don't forget to like, subscribe. Bye, guys.